blessed. God is good. I mean, every, every game is a must-win game, and uh, put everything we got into this one, and you know, get ready for the next one too. So, watching your pregame warmups, work the tell off down there in that end zone, going through the bag stuff. Um, just where the work it took you to get to this point. And I know you've been dealing with some injuries over the years, but it seems like you and Matt have a really good rapport with each other. How much have you learned from him to help develop your game to this point? I mean, I've learned a lot. I mean, you know, been through a lot of adversity and. Uh, just leaning back on my faith, my family, my teammates, you know, my girl, my parent, everybody. Like, just leaning back on them and them just helping me, you know, stay up. And Judon is just, you know, he's been a blessing in my life, man. And that's that's big bro. And um, I don't know, I don't know where I'd be without him. And the rest of the guys, D Wise and you name it, my my boy Anthony, my locker mate, just those guys, man. It's just we feed off of each other, and you know, just a great group of guys in the locker room, you know. So. Josh, when you play this game back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was big time. I mean, you know, Doug got a big play in him, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's Doug, big hit Doug. And uh, Quan getting, you know, busy on there, you know what I'm saying? He looked like a running back out there. But, you know, um, it was just great, man, a momentum changer, you know, when we needed it, put points up on the board. And defense, you know, we just out there, you know, playing for each other, and it was great. How much fun is it to unload on the quarterbacks when you, know, you guys racked up, what, six sacks? I mean, it's something where everyone just has to do their job, and whoever gets there gets there, and it's like we just – Make sure we're, you know, executing our assignments. And, uh, you know, if they come, they come. If not, you know, it is what it is as long as, you know, we get the job done. So, How much pride do you guys take defensively to score points, make plays on defense, especially when the offense seems to be struggling the first half? Oh, we take a lot of pride, man. I mean, any time a defense can put up points on the board, it's demoralizing to an offense. And uh, it's a moment, momentum changer. And, uh, you know, yeah, it just fires us up. It fires the offense up. And, you know, everyone's just back in the game. So definitely, definitely a great feeling. Every time you guys in a big play, the crowd will, like, even if on the press box, was a little bit more silent, mm -hmm. you could feel it down there. Did it feel like a, a home game at Gillette Stadium? Or how was that? Yeah, I mean, Pats fans always travel well. And, uh, you know, definitely did, they did a great job tonight. Just felt like a home game. I had to tell guys to chill out, some of the fans to chill. They were getting a little too excited rooting for us, you know. Game wasn't over yet. But, um, yeah, Pats Nation, best uh, fans in the world, and uh, can't complain. We just stick to whatever the coach calls. Whatever coach calls, you know, we running it. And, you know, executing our assignments it doesn't matter who's in there per se. It's just everyone doing their job. So, yeah. What did you learn, if anything, that you didn't know tonight about the defense and the way that it can maybe? Uh, nothing. I mean, we going to work hard till the whistle blows. And, um, you know, until the whistle blows, until that clock hits zero, we giving it everything we got. And we playing for each other. And, you know, it's just relentless. And, uh. Just love those guys in the locker room and the love we have for each other is just, you know, that's what, you know, was on display tonight. So you realize you're back in the playoff picture now? Listen, we focus on the next game and we gonna handle that when we handle that. So yeah. Thanks, Josh. Cool. Thanks, Josh. For sure. Thank you, Josh. Appreciate you, guys.